What's up guys, it's Jeff from 51911 Gaming. Uh, today I'm going to bring you the video of the way that we do uh, the weasel fight here in Operation Dark Hours. Um, we have a pretty good success rate. With this raid so far, I think uh, I'm in Odyssey Clan. Um, I think we have over a thousand clears of this raid. So when you come in the room, there's going to be a computer. Push the button on the computer and go down these ropes. Now, we do A side, B side. Subgroup 1 is on A, subgroup 2 is on B. Now, it's very important that when... So when I explain it to people that we're running through, you basically, if you get the eye on you for the boss, there's pillars. If you see right there in the middle of the screen towards the top, there's pillars in that room there right behind Captain Canada. Don't take cover because he's going to shoot grenades at you. Okay, you have to use the pillars as a barrier between you and the boss without taking cover, without trying to shoot him. It's not important. What's important is you staying alive and you keeping the aggro on the boss and keeping that pillar between you and the boss. Now, when somebody else is shooting him, they're going to get aggro and they're going to do the same thing keep the boss between you and the pillar and don't take cover so also in the back you'll see you see a, a window up there a sniper is going to appear up the in the window up there and they're going to put out a drone that shocks you number one priority is the drone number two priority is the sniper number three priority is keeping the pillar between you and the boss so the sniper and the drone have to go down when, as soon as they come out, or they're just going to start one-shotting. So to start fight here, you have to go to the control panel. It'll be on one of these three screens, either the front, middle, or back of the plane. You have to hit them in simultaneously with a person on the other side. So you have to talk to each other. It's in the middle. In, okay, press in three, two, one, go. And you hit the button, and the gas comes out. So now if you see that debuff, the red debuff, that's the debuff or the buff from the certain gas that you you have on your side here. So the purple is poison, okay? And the longer you're in it, the more health damage you're going to start taking. So you need to switch him at about 15 or so. So you run over, you hit 3, 2, 1, hit the button, and it switches. So now the orange gas here is the gas that allows you to do DPS on the boss. The purple gas doesn't. You, there is no DPS on the boss with the purple gas because it, it, it negates your damage and reduces it to like two, three hundred, four hundred. So it's not, that's not the damage phase for that side of the arena. So all you have to do is just see how they're keeping him. The boss is shooting at him, but he's behind the pillar. So it's not hitting him. So it allows us to be able to hit him. And we're watching, so now the buff's at 15, and then we go back over to the plane. It's at the back of the plane. You ready, Biggie? Three, two, one, go. And boom, they switch. That's how fast you have to do it. It has to be done quickly because if the purple side gets too much poison on them, they're all just going to start dropping dead. They're going to drop dead. So it's just the timing on that and keeping the boss in between you and the pillar. So... I think one of our guys is running aces and eights here, so that's why I was using uh, the nemesis on that um, that sniper. But if you look, Dizzy's health is almost, his armor's gone, and all he needs is a couple more shots. So now we have to wait for um, them to kill Ricochet, because we want the boss Weasel to drop on the other side, onto B side. Because... It's much easier on this side to fight him than it is on the other side because there's more cover. There's larger cover. Um, it takes him a while to go from A side or from B side to A side. It takes him a while to walk there. So that's that's free damage on him as he's walking over. Um, as you can see, I'm starting to take health damage from the poison on the side because it's we're having an issue with being confused and, and trying to hit the thing at the same time. Because he ke I keep getting confused on this side by the, by the poison. Or he keeps getting confused on the other side because of the orange gas. I'm being poisoned on this side 
from the purple gas. And that's why I went down there from, uh, from the damage from the poison. Because you, you, can't, you can't heal it. It's health damage. So we finally get it figured out. Someone else said, I guess I think Biggie was getting, uh, had the boss on him. So we figure it out. Now we're now I'm just waiting here, trying to hit the uh, hit the button. So now we get it, and now he's on me. As soon as you hit the button, he's going to aggro you. So whoever's hitting the button is going to get the eye, and and you have to just basically stay away from him. Um, what I do is I use that forklift right there. It works pretty well because there's a barrier. So now the plane we. Get them both down. The plane goes up. So now ads are going to drop in from the ceiling on both sides. And Weasel's going to drop in from the window on the on the side that you ki the last one was killed. So And see how we're all on this side. And, and he's he's over there. And, and it's just free damage from, from way over there. So um, the ads just keep coming and coming and coming. So you just have to keep putting damage on him. So uh, I think Donut had aces, and so he's calling aces, and that's where we're just going to melt his his armor off. If, if you can see, I'm shooting, that was a 4,042,000, 442,000 shot there. There's another 4.7 million shot on his head. So aces and eights works really well with this fight. It just melts their armor off, and, th and that's what you want. You don't want to, you don't want to hang out and BS over here in, in this poison or, or or take this fight take longer than it has to so it's just it's be it's way beneficial way more beneficial than, than not having it but you have to have the right build to run it you can't just go in there and say hey I got a full set of aces and eights let's go no no you need a you need a, a, a good set um, build to, to run it so there we go we beat him I think it was about nine minutes or so so the key points in this fight are take care of the snipers immediately with their drones the gas as you saw get keep the gas switched back and forth at 15 no more than 15 because you see what happens I, I went down because of the, the health damage to the poison because it gets starts getting stronger and stronger and stronger as it goes and then keep the boss between you and the pillar and that's it and then just can add control at the end when weasel drops down so I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I'm going to try to do Buddy and Lucy tomorrow. Uh, if you liked it, give me a like and a subscribe. And uh, be safe out there, huh?